Hello everyone. So in today's video, I'll be covering one way, one special way that you can use to make literally billions of honey for free without spending anything at all. So this item I am talking about is the Onyx Lidar, which you can unlock by completing his Beastmas quest, which is this right here, which is pretty easy, obviously. But my main point in talking about this is because on um, what did odd what the Lidar gives. So it gives like a couple bees and some cool items, you know, like some tickets or whatever. But the main thing I'm talking about is basically it gives you a free sub a, a free guiding star, which is a supreme star amulet passive. So this can help a ton for any early game players. But I'll basically just try completing this quest and show you on show you why it's so overpowered. So yeah. Okay, and I finished with this quest, and it took like two seconds, cause like you know, test run was OP. So yeah. Anyways, let's do this. So let's turn it in. So yeah, I don't really care about any of these rewards, but my main point is by using this honest letter. So before I start doing all of this stuff, this video is mainly o only for early gamers or like maybe mid gamers, you could say. But basically. I don't see most early gamers using this item enough, which is the Honest Lit Art, obviously, because, you know, I'm going to use this, and as you can see right here, and you get all these cool bees, but the main thing you get is this Guiding Star. Okay, so like I said before, like, this video is only important for early gamers, mostly just because they're a mixed hive, because if you're like a red hive, then the only guiding stars that can really help you are in red field, such as like, you know, strawberry and stuff. And if you're like in a blue hive, then you, you know, just like the same stuff. But, but why the guiding star is so good for early gamers is because of what it gives. So I can quickly pull this up right here. So you get a multiplier of 2.5 capacity and the same thing for convert rate and pollen. And I do not see early gamers using this thing enough. And the cooldown is 8 hours, so you can so it can use this three times a day but that's three times a day you can probably make literally billions of like millions of honey if not billions depending on how like depending on what level your hive is but but i can clearly like literally do just a short boost and then see how it goes and you can see right here i'm already i'm already getting around like 500,000 honey per actually ignore my guiding ignore my gummy star here sorry but you can see right here i'm getting around 500,000 honey a second which is pretty good for a early gamer because that's literally just like 1 million honey in a few seconds which, which is quite a lot for them actually so yeah you can see right here I I only have like a purple potion added and I can actually just show my hive here but and you can see my hive here it's literally I think I replicated a early gamer hive I hope I did but you know it has like like a few mythic bees and mostly just rare bees and stuff but I can go back to the boost and just to literally show you how how much honey that these early that and like literally any hive it could be missing out on so and also i forgot to mention that this guiding star does last for 10 minutes so that's be literally basically basically 10 minutes of free buffs right here so it is insanely overpowered so yeah and you can see right here i'm already getting a, i'm already my honey is already increasing by quite a lot so yeah and that is basically just of my video and you can see right here that's just literally a short video i just wanted to let like you know any early gamers know about this um this guiding star but yeah that's basically it and yeah if you're an early gamer or a mid gamer then please start using the guiding star or sorry the lit art more because yeah you're missing out on a lot of honey potentially so yeah